Flaxmere residents are fuming that foodstuffs is closing the local New World, leaving 11,000 people without a supermarket. The grocery giant says the building in the Hastings suburb isn't up to standard, so it's not renewing the lease. Alexa Cook reports. In just one month, this New World will shut up shop, a decision that's left locals reeling. I'm really disappointed, in fact I'm pissed off, that they would do something like this so quickly. Oh, I think it's going to cripple Flaxmere. It's, it's going to hurt. It's going to hurt a lot of people. Especially those with mobility issues. People will now have to travel about seven kilometres to get their groceries. It's actually quite a big shock to hear that it's closed in the supermarket. Instead of renewing its lease, Foodstuffs is closing the store in a month. It's the only supermarket for a population of 11,000 in one of New Zealand's most socio-economically deprived areas, where the average income is well below the national average. A lot of people don't have the uh, accessibility of vehicles and their supermarket is critically important to them. Mums and dads, you know, uh, solo parents with no cars and they got babies, how are they going to get to the supermarkets in town. The supermarket chain declined our request for an interview, saying even if the landlord invested in the building, it still wouldn't be up to standard. Foodstuffs is now consulting with its 60 employees who are feeling blindsided. They're just all in shock, just speechless. They didn't think something like this would happen. A petition to prevent the closure has already gained about 1,500 signatures. However, locals don't hold much hope after plans to build a new supermarket in Flaxmere were scrapped at the last minute in 2023. Uh, the deal was done and they pulled out of that. And what they were said to us then was they were committed to serving their community. And look, one year later, they're pulling out. Although some plan to keep up the fight. Oh, save our supermarket, Flaxmere! Yeah. Yeah. Alexa Cook, News Hub.